Hi, it's Adrian here from Top10PokerSites.net. Now today I'm looking at why poker is so popular and I'm going to give you the six reasons why it is as popular as it is. Now poker is an incredibly popular game. We all know that. It's hard to find a person who hasn't heard about poker and it's certainly easy to find people who play it. The latest numbers say that there are around 60 million poker players in the USA alone and more than 100 million worldwide. Most players in the USA play in some of the best poker sites in the world. When these numbers are considered, there are more poker players in the world than players of some of very popular sports like golf or tennis, for example. So it's clear that poker is popular, but we still don't know why it's popular. Well, that's precisely what I'm here to answer. I did the research and decided to give you six crucial reasons. Let's take a look. The convenience of online poker. Poker has always been popular, but never more so than today. One of the main reasons for that is that online poker is accessible to anybody worldwide. Millions of people are playing poker variants like Texas Hold'em and Omaha, both of which are available online. The best part is that these games are exactly the same online as they are in real life. The only downside of online poker is that you don't get the same thrills you feel when playing on a true poker table with cards you can touch, surrounded by real players. Things like bluffing and body language play a big part here, all of which are not present in online poker. This is unfortunate, but necessary, and most players don't mind playing poker online, as the main parts of poker are still there. The game is still played live, and you're still playing with real players, that's what matters. Many people believe that poker is all about luck, just like most of the games of chance. However, poker was explicitly designed to make it more about the skills of each player and only partly about luck. What's more, if you look at the long run, poker is completely skill based. A significant amount of luck is involved in the short run, but professional players deal with that by learning the best poker strategies. You can do the same, and the better skills you get, the more you'll be able to win. That's precisely why the players who win the most in poker tournaments, for example, and other major events, are those with the most skills and experience. Professional players know that poker is all about the maths and odds. To win, you need to invest more when you have a statistical advantage, and invest less when you have a disadvantage. Naturally, there's a lot more to it than that, but this is the gist of things, and you need to be aware of it before you start playing poker as a real professional. All games in the world are played to win, and poker is no different. However, many players believe that most players play the game only to win money, and they forget that the main goal of many professional players is the win itself. It's true that money is a powerful motivator, but as is usually the case with games and sports, people, eat, people usually start playing them for the sake of winning. Poker is exciting and makes you incredibly competitive, which is the main motive for more, most players. Naturally, they know the money won't hurt, but the competitiveness is often so overwhelming that you're ready to invest a lot just to win. The rush of adrenaline you get when playing and when you win is intoxicating, and anyone who has ever played poker knows that. Poker is so popular because it's a social activity. Unlike many of the games of chance, you play poker with other people. What's more, you play against each other, which is rarely the case with other social games of chance, like blackjack. That fact makes poker a perfect game for friends and tournaments. That's precisely why many people often play poker at their homes with friends and family, and why so many tournaments exist. The popularity of poker tournaments is so overwhelming that the maximum prize pools often range in the millions of dollars. The importance of skills is not the only factor that separates poker from other games of chance. The legality matters as well. Unlike many other casino games that are often illegal, the rules around poker are often less stringent. This essentially has to do with the fact that poker is mostly a game of skill, and games like that are outlawed to much a lesser extent than games of pure chance like slots or blackjack. Naturally, in the US, poker is still mostly illegal, especially online poker. 
However, four states have made online poker legal. New Jersey, Nevada, Delaware and Pennsylvania. That combined with the fact that players join offshore sites is more than enough to warrant the high number of poker players in the US. All in all, thanks to the legality of poker all around the globe, the game is consequently more accessible to regular players than other games of chance. What's more, many countries are looking to legalise poker, including many US states. This is enough to make the game a lot more popular than other casino games. In the end, poker's popularity is connected to its place in our culture. Even certain phrases from everyday speech are influenced by poker. Common phrases like the chips are down, wild card and folded all come from poker. Then there are movies and songs, many of which are about poker or include poker. Many of these are about casinos in general, but when it comes to specific games, it is often poker and to a lesser extent blackjack and roulette. All in all, when we consider all these reasons, it becomes quite clear why poker is popular in today's world. Now that you know what makes it so attractive, it's time for me to leave you and get back to playing Texas Hold'em. To gamble legally in the USA, you need to be over 21 years of age. Always gamble responsibly and please set your limits. When the fun stops, stop.